Hey y'all, welcome to another minifigure review uh, with Crisis Monday. So, um, yeah, today we're going to be reviewing Ninja Black. This is from the Ninja series, not Ninjago. Uh, Ninja series from, I believe, the 1990s or 80s from Lego. It's actually a really nice series. They, uh, I also have the Black, or no, the Red Ninja, and a couple of the uh, Black Ninja um, uh, torsos, but I got finally got the full minifigure. I'm going to use him the torsos to make some uh, League of Shadows minifigures like goons because uh, that's the main reason I got this figure is to make some League of Shadow goons for like Batman, Ra's al Ghul, and such. Anyway, let's take a look at the figure. So, first of all, he has this, of course, pretty nice torso. Take off the uh, he's got a sort of a Knife in there, as well as a ninja star, I believe. That's what it appears to be. And a nice sort of fold, and some shiny... Up near his neck, like sort of a shiny V-neck. Maybe that could be like some kind of chain armor or something he's hiding under. In case he gets uh, shot with an arrow or something. I'm not exactly sure. That might make it hard for him to be a little agile, though, if he's supposed to be a ninja. He's got this nice uh, face. Um, in a lot of Vietnam movies, you'll see they use these uh, faces, because it's, I believe, the only... Asian like faces um, Lego made. Uh, then he has this ninja mask, which I believe was also used in Ninjago, although uh, there was an updated version. He has this clip here, which you can put uh, th most things in, although it's a little, um, not the most reliable clip. And that's all there really is to this figure. It's a nice figure, nice addition if you want to have him to get the face, the torso. Or just that uh, headpiece. So really nice figure. Not too expensive to get. He's only about three seventy seven used uh, or ten dollars new. Um, this is the average price. Is probably if you outlies there. It's not that expensive. But anyway, let's take a look at the sets he came in. So this figure came in a few sets. Uh, one of which was actually a real re release. Excuse me. So first of all, he came in robbers retreat raft, which is also water spider poly bag. Mini Heroes Collection, Ninja Knights, Ninja Surprise, Samurai Stronghold, Stone Tower Bridge, and finally, Ninja Flying Fortress. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Please make sure to like and subscribe, and check out the stop motions which I have been putting at the end of all of my minifigure reviews. Uh, please share this to a friend if you feel like it, because I'm, uh, yeah, I'm sad.